Welcome to a journey of discovery, where we unravel the mysterious link between inflammation and your daily choices. Welcome to Wellness Central, where wellness is essential. Have you ever wondered why, despite your efforts, you still feel sluggish, achy, or just not quite right? Well, it might just be inflammation, the silent saboteur lurking within. But fear not, because today, we're diving deep into the 20 unexpected culprits fueling inflammation in your body. So fasten your seatbelts and get ready for a ride packed with eye-opening insights and actionable tips to reclaim your vitality. 1. Poor sleep. The relationship between sleep and inflammation is intricate, with poor sleep quality or insufficient sleep triggering the release of inflammatory molecules, fostering chronic inflammation. This disruption not only compromises immune function by altering cytokine balance, but also disrupts hormonal regulation, elevating cortisol levels, and impeding growth hormone secretion essential for tissue repair. Moreover, inadequate sleep renders individuals more vulnerable to infections, exacerbating inflammation. Prioritizing optimal sleep duration and quality, addressing underlying sleep disorders, and maintaining good sleep hygiene are pivotal in managing inflammation and fostering overall health and well-being. 2. Stress Chronic stress triggers the release of hormones like cortisol, disrupting the body's inflammatory response and potentially leading to increased inflammation, which, over time, contributes to various health issues, such as cardiovascular disease and autoimmune disorders. Stress management techniques, such as meditation, yoga, and deep breathing exercises, play a crucial role in mitigating these effects by lowering cortisol levels, promoting relaxation, and enhancing overall well-being. Through regular practice, these techniques help restore balance to the immune system, reduce inflammation markers, and improve resilience to stressors, thereby fostering a healthier physiological state and reducing the risk of stress-related health complications. 3. Processed Foods High consumption of processed foods, particularly those containing trans fats, refined sugars, and refined carbohydrates, contributes to inflammation in the body. Trans fats found in processed foods like margarine and fried snacks increase levels of inflammatory markers such as interleukin-6, IL-6, and tumor necrosis factor alpha, TNF-alpha. Refined sugars such as high fructose corn syrup lead to rapid spikes in blood sugar levels, triggering the release of inflammatory cytokines like interleukin-1-beta, IL-1-bit, and interleukin-6, IL-6. Additionally, refined carbohydrates in processed foods like white flour and white rice, have a high glycemic index, further promoting inflammation. Additives and preservatives in processed foods may also contribute to inflammatory responses. Overall, a diet rich in whole foods, fruits, and vegetables is recommended to reduce inflammation and promote optimal health. 4. Soda and energy drinks. Sugary beverages such as soda and energy drinks can contribute to inflammation in the body through multiple mechanisms. Their high fructose content, when metabolized in the liver, can lead to the production of harmful byproducts like uric acid and free radicals, triggering inflammatory responses. Additionally, regular consumption of these drinks can increase insulin resistance due to the rapid spikes in blood sugar levels they induce, disrupting the body's ability to regulate blood sugar effectively. Insulin resistance further exacerbates inflammation linking the consumption of sugary beverages to chronic inflammatory conditions associated with various health risks, such as cardiovascular disease and type 2 diabetes. Therefore, limiting the intake of soda and energy drinks is essential in reducing inflammation and promoting better overall health. 5. Alcohol Excessive alcohol consumption can induce heightened inflammation and oxidative stress within the body, contributing to a range of health issues. This excessive intake triggers an inflammatory response and disrupts the balance between free radicals and antioxidants, leading to oxidative stress. Chronic inflammation and oxidative stress are linked to various health problems, such as cardiovascular disease, liver disease, and cancer. Therefore, moderation in alcohol consumption is emphasized as crucial. While moderate drinking may offer some health benefits, surpassing recommended limits can amplify the risk of inflammation and oxidative damage underscoring the importance of moderation for overall well-being. 6. Non-sterile kitchen utensils Using non-sterile kitchen utensils can introduce harmful bacteria into your food, potentially leading to inflammation in your digestive system and resulting in conditions like irritable bowel syndrome, IBS. 
it's crucial to clean your utensils thoroughly after each use to prevent bacterial buildup. This involves washing them with hot, soapy water and ensuring they are completely dry before reuse. Additionally, practicing good hygiene habits such as using separate utensils for raw meats and regularly sanitizing kitchen surfaces can further reduce the risk of inflammation-related health issues and maintain a safe cooking environment. 7. Dental Problems Gum disease characterized by bacterial infection and inflammation of the gums, and tooth decay, caused by bacterial acids eroding tooth enamel, represent common oral health issues that can lead to more significant systemic consequences. When plaque accumulates on teeth, it hardens into tartar, fostering gum irritation and inflammation, a condition known as periodontitis. The body responds to these oral infections by initiating an immune-mediated inflammatory response. 8. Lack of Exercise Lack of exercise can significantly impact inflammation in the body through several mechanisms. Sedentary lifestyles may lead to reduced blood circulation, hindering the efficient delivery of oxygen and nutrients to tissues and resulting in inflammation. Additionally, increased weight gain from lack of physical activity can trigger inflammation, as excess fat cells release inflammatory chemicals. Moreover, Compromised immune function and poor overall health associated with inactivity contribute to chronic low-grade inflammation. 9. Smoking Smoking inflicts damage on the lungs and triggers systemic inflammation throughout the body, leading to increased levels of inflammatory markers in the bloodstream. This inflammation is implicated in various health issues, including respiratory conditions like chronic bronchitis and systemic diseases, such as cardiovascular disorders and diabetes. However, Quitting smoking initiates a process of healing and repair within the body, resulting in a significant reduction in inflammation levels over time. 10. Air Pollution Exposure to air pollution triggers inflammation in the lungs and other vital organs, heightening the susceptibility to chronic diseases like asthma, COPD, and cardiovascular ailments. Prolonged inhalation of pollutants exacerbates this inflammatory response, leading to compromised respiratory function and systemic health issues. To mitigate these risks, individuals are advised to minimize outdoor activities during high pollution periods and employ air purifiers indoors to reduce exposure. 11. Overuse of antibacterial products. Excessive use of antibacterial products disrupts the balance of beneficial bacteria in the body, known as the microbiome, leading to a condition called dysbiosis. This imbalance triggers inflammation as the body's immune system reacts to restore equilibrium potentially resulting in chronic inflammation. Chronic inflammation has been associated with various health issues, including skin disorders, digestive problems, and autoimmune conditions. To mitigate this risk, it's advisable to opt for regular soap and water for hand washing instead of solely relying on antibacterial products as it effectively cleanses without disturbing the microbiome's delicate balance, thus promoting overall health and reducing the likelihood of inflammation-related complications. 12. Lack of vitamin D. Vitamin D is critical for regulating the immune system, including inflammation, which is the body's response to infection or injury, but can become harmful if chronic. Research suggests that vitamin D deficiency can lead to immune imbalance and heightened inflammation, potentially contributing to various health issues. Sunlight exposure and dietary sources like fatty fish and fortified foods are crucial for maintaining optimal vitamin D levels. In cases of deficiency, Supplementation may be necessary to support immune function and regulate inflammation. Emphasizing the importance of sunlight exposure and a diet rich in vitamin D for overall health. 13. Artificial sweeteners. Research suggests that artificial sweeteners like aspartame may trigger inflammation and other health concerns, potentially due to their disruptive effects on gut microbiota balance and blood sugar regulation. While findings are not conclusive and individual responses may vary, opting for natural sweeteners such as honey or stevia is often recommended as a safer alternative. These natural sweeteners offer potential health benefits, such as antioxidants in honey and anti-inflammatory properties in both honey and stevia, making them preferable choices for individuals seeking to minimize potential risks associated with artificial sweetener consumption. 14. Non-organic meat and dairy Conventionally raised animals are typically administered antibiotics and hormones as part of their growth and health management, with antibiotics used to prevent diseases and promote growth and hormones employed to enhance growth rates or milk production. 
These substances can persist in the meat and dairy products derived from these animals. Upon consumption, residues of antibiotics and hormones may disturb the delicate balance of bacteria in the gut, potentially triggering inflammation. Chronic inflammation is not only uncomfortable, but also linked to a myriad of health conditions, including heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. 15. Leaky Gut Syndrome Leaky Gut Syndrome a condition characterized by increased intestinal permeability due to damage to the intestinal lining poses significant implications for overall health. When the integrity of the intestinal barrier is compromised, harmful substances like toxins and pathogens can penetrate the bloodstream, triggering a cascade of inflammatory responses throughout the body. This chronic inflammation not only exacerbates the symptoms associated with leaky gut syndrome, but also contributes to the development and progression of various health issues including autoimmune disorders like rheumatoid arthritis and inflammatory bowel diseases, such as Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Moreover, prolonged inflammation is linked to an elevated risk of chronic conditions like cardiovascular disease, diabetes, and certain cancers. 16. Chronic Infections Chronic infections, such as hepatitis C or Lyme disease, instigate a relentless battle within the body as the immune system mounts a sustained defense against the persistent invaders, this ongoing immune response triggers a cascade of inflammatory processes aimed at neutralizing the infectious agents. However, the prolonged nature of these infections keeps the immune system perpetually activated, leading to a state of chronic inflammation. Within this inflammatory milieu, immune cells continuously release pro-inflammatory molecules such as cytokines and chemokines, perpetuating the inflammatory cycle. Unfortunately, the indiscriminate nature of the immune response can also result in collateral damage to healthy tissues and organs, as immune cells mistakenly attack them along with the pathogens. This chronic inflammation gradually undermines tissue integrity, leading to complications such as tissue scarring and organ dysfunction. 17. Food Sensitivities Undiagnosed food sensitivities or allergies can set off an immune cascade within the body, initiating an inflammatory response as a protective mechanism. This immune reaction involves the release of inflammatory mediators such as histamine, cytokines, and other chemical messengers, which trigger physiological changes aimed at eliminating perceived threats from the offending foods. These changes often manifest as localized symptoms such as swelling, redness, itching, and discomfort, affecting various bodily systems depending on individual susceptibility. 18. Chronic Dehydration Chronic Dehydration characterized by prolonged insufficient water intake, instigates a complex interplay of physiological responses within the body, ultimately culminating in systemic inflammation. At the cellular level, dehydration induces stress by depriving cells of the vital hydration necessary for optimal function, disrupting metabolic processes and cellular integrity, thereby triggering inflammatory pathways. Moreover, dehydration compromises the body's natural detoxification mechanisms, hindering the efficient elimination of metabolic waste and toxins. This leads to the accumulation of harmful substances within tissues, prompting an immune response and further exacerbating inflammation. 19. Excessive Omega-6 Fatty Acids Certainly, Omega-6 and Omega-3 fatty acids are both types of polyunsaturated fats, essential for various bodily functions. However, maintaining a balance between these two types of fatty acids is crucial for overall health. When there's an excessive intake of omega-6 fatty acids compared to omega-3s, it can lead to an imbalance in the body. Omega-6 fatty acids are pro-inflammatory, meaning they have the potential to promote inflammation when consumed in large amounts. 20. Environmental Toxins Exposure to environmental toxins like heavy metals, pesticides, and bisphenol A, a BPA, found in everyday products can provoke inflammation in the body through multiple mechanisms. Heavy metals such as lead, mercury, and cadmium disrupt cellular functions, leading to oxidative stress and the production of reactive oxygen species ROS, thereby promoting inflammation. Pesticides, widely used in agriculture and public health, disrupt immune function and trigger inflammatory pathways in immune cells, contributing to the release of inflammatory cytokines. As we conclude our exploration into the realm of inflammation, remember that knowledge is power. Armed with the understanding of how various factors influence inflammation, you now possess the tools to make conscious choices for your well-being. So let's embark on this journey together, not as passive spectators, 
but as empowered agents of change. Together, we can kick inflammation to the curb and pave the way for a vibrant, energetic life. Don't miss out on future revelations and wellness wisdom. Hit that subscribe button and join our community dedicated to unlocking the secrets of health and vitality. Thank you for watching Wellness Central where wellness is essential.